If you have a history of periodontal disease, it's vital that we keep a close eye on the health of your gums so we can prevent a recurrence of this destructive infection. But if you've been treated for periodontal disease, why should you worry about recurrence? Because periodontal disease cannot be cured, it can only be controlled. And if it isn't closely monitored and controlled, over time, periodontal disease can eventually cause you to lose your teeth. Usually, if we're concerned about the depth of your periodontal pockets, we'll recommend periodontal therapy called scaling and root planing to remove contamination and infection from beneath your gums. Following this treatment, we'll have you come to see us every few months for ongoing care, which may include x-rays, a re-evaluation of your periodontal health and the effectiveness of your home care, removal of plaque above and beneath the gum line, and retreatment with scaling and root planing if necessary. These frequent checkups are vital to the process of controlling your periodontal disease. It's important that you know that periodontal disease is site-specific. What this means is that you may experience a flare-up of the infection in just one periodontal pocket out of the possible 192 that exist in your mouth. And bone and tissue loss might occur in only this isolated area, or it might be more widespread. Consequently, if we aren't checking regularly for this type of damage or change in your gums, you would have no way of knowing that it's occurring, and the destruction would continue unchecked. After we've treated your periodontal disease by removing plaque from above and below your gum line, we've disrupted the growth of bacteria. Still, some do remain, and these may settle back into the pocket and once again begin the process of repopulating and destroying bone and soft tissue. In as little as 90 days, the bacteria can reach destructive levels once again. Because of the episodic nature of periodontal disease, and in light of the fact that periodontal disease can re-establish itself in as little as 90 days, the typical six-month recare appointment just isn't advisable for those who have periodontal disease. Statistics support that re-evaluation and recare is critical at least every three or four months. More frequent visits are a vital step in maintaining your oral health. They help us break the stronghold of bacteria in your gums, minimize the recurrence of the infection, and slow or eliminate its destructive effects.